Now, the Columbus Pride Fest is getting into full swing, and music is going to be a major part of this weekend's celebration. And several of the musicians have stories of pride to share. 10 TV's Jason Frazier is live tonight from Goodale Park with one of those stories. Jason. Well, Tracy, they just finished up doing some sound checks uh, on the stage just a few feet away from where I'm standing. The music is expected to kick off here in a moment, but as you can see behind me, the crowd is slowly starting to build here at Goodale Park. Now, one of the folks performing here tonight is former Christian artist Jennifer Knapp. After being nominated back in 2001 for a Grammy, she tells me she took off time from the music industry. But when her album came out several years ago, she admitted that she was gay after questions surfaced about her sexual orientation. She says that she knew she'd be criticized by some fans and fellow followers. That's a real difficult thing to kind of be able to navigate. Um, a lot of people don't really know how to to make space for something we've been told for so long as, as like that gay people are bad or that there's something wrong or mysterious about all of this. And I think that's what appeals to me about Pride Festivals and being able to go and just be me. And Knapp says she still does sing about God in her music. You can hear her performance here at Goodale Park starting at 630. But at 6, we will have more on how organizers are keeping everyone here safe. Reporting live, Jason Frazier, 10 TV News. Thank you, Jason. There are going to be a lot of closures because of the extra traffic downtown after the uh, Pride Festival. So to make sure you get around this weekend without delay, 10 TV's Karina Nova joins us now with a look at what's going to be closed and the detours. Saturday afternoon, you'll run into problems driving through the short north and downtown. More than 200,000 people are expected to show up for the parade. And right now, these are the roads that are closed around Goodale Park. Goodale Street at High and Denison, Park Street at Buttles and Swan. And Saturday, Denison and Hubbard Avenues will be closed. Also on Saturday at noon, the Pride Parade steps off from Front Street and Broad Street. You can expect rolling closures as the parade proceeds north on High, to Buttles, then west from Buttles to Denison Avenue. And of course, since there'll be thousands of people in the area, you want to watch out for pedestrians. Karina Nova, 10 TV News.